So, Sorry. here we are, we're looking at um, a 22HD. I've had a couple of questions, and I just wanted to clarify what the possible issues are that can be wrong with this. There's really only two possible issues. And the way to figure out which of the two possible issues is pretty simple. You get the board, get it down to this. Can you come this? And all you have to do is remove this cable, which connects up top here. Just simply unplug that. And then you plug the power into the main board right here. You're going to go over and you're going to look at the front of it. And when you plug that in, either you'll notice that this will glow a slight purple lit color for a moment, or it won't. In this case, it's not. So when it doesn't glow, that means that there are five transistors on this board that you want to replace. There's one here, there's one here, one here, one here, and one on the other side. They're all labeled with a Q, and they're all labeled with a Q like that, if you can see it. See how there's a Q there? So this one's Q14, one up here, down there, Q24, one over here, this one is uh, Q20, one over here is Q18, and the one on the other side I think is Q1. Um, so that's on the underside. So that's if you don't get a flash. If you do see a flash, there are several capacitors on this board up top here that you have to replace. So you simply have to unscrew these three screws across here. I'll show them again. One screw, two screw, three screw. And then there are several capacitors on that board up there that you have to replace. Now this one doesn't need those replaced, so we're not going to open that. I'll do another video again. I, I think in some of my previous videos I replaced those capacitors. Um, but basically, either you do you take this off, no flash, board's a problem. Flash, this board's a problem. Alright, that's it. Simple.